My name is Grace, I'm from Burlington, Vermont. So we are at the Northwestern University Feinberg Simulation Lab. We're working with simulation equipment to learn different like surgical skills and some of the equipment that doctors and surgeons and physicians use every day to practice their skills. We got to use real equipment that doctors use every day to look at different veins and arteries in the body and we used the equipment to look at some of the veins and arteries in the dummies but also in our cells. It, that was really awesome. I love working with my hands and doing all this hands-on stuff is something that I don't really get to do at home. I am Jacob. I'm from Wooddale, Illinois. The first thing that we did was we were given um, these pegs and the uh, triangles that were on the pegs. We were supposed to manipulate these two uh, kind of little uh, uh, claws, as it were, and we were supposed to take it with our left um, claw and um, pick it up, transfer it to your dominant hand, and place it on the other peg and um, transfer all the triangles to the other pegs. Surprisingly, I got it pretty well. It was not actually that as hard as I thought it would be. I had like two hiccups where I dropped the peg or I dropped the actual triangle, so those things you have to be very careful with. My name is Michaela and I'm from Miami, Florida. We did CPR, we walked in and there was these blow-up dolls. We watched a couple videos of a professional that does CPR and then we took turns on the doll to demonstrate. We did compressions, we learned about an AED, and then we had a chance to go into a larger room with a life-size dummy and practice on that. One thing that I learned was that like this actually can happen like in a real situation. You really do have to act fast and everything is like in your memory. So once you learn it, it's like stuck in your head and then you can really act on it.